Hello, and welcome to episode four of Will Plays Firewatch. I'm Will, and uh, let's continue where we left off last time. All right. Uh, I found an axe. If one of the crew left it, that thing is actually called a Pulaski. It looks like an axe to me. This thing will be a huge help. For both getting through the back country and getting through that fence. Yeah, I'm out of here. All right, let's get going. Go to Wapiti Meadow. Wapiti Meadow. All right, let's hike. Maybe we can try jumping the gap in the bridge. Maybe not. Gotta find a way across that ravine. Otherwise, we'll be stuck here. All right. That's one way to create a path. <laughs> All right, let's get back to that fence and I guess we're gonna cut through it. Are you there? I, I had a thought. Let's hear it. You heard someone in the bushes. Yeah. Okay, so let's assume we're being tailed. Or you are, at least. Where are you right now? Just on my way back, in and out of trees in the middle of nowhere. Do you see anybody? No, definitely not. All right, so uh, tell me what you think of this. <coughs> Did you just cough? No. Did you just cough? No. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. Um, there isn't any way someone, like, another lookout could be on this line, is there? No. Not without tapping our radios. Get in your tower, shut the door. Don't leave and don't use your radio. I'll call you. Understand? I will call you. Okay. This is getting pretty interesting, guys. Thoroughfare Tower, this is Two Forks calling you for the... Oh, 50th time today. <laughs> the June fire continues to move in a southerly fashion. Delilah, for fuck's sake, answer your radio. Hello, sunshine. Sorry, went out for a little bit. What can I do you for? Are you kidding right now? Did you not stay up all night knowing that someone is... I actually slept just great. Uh, okay. By the way, I was wondering if your flora of the Shoshone info poster was still up inside your tower? What? It's just protocol that those stay up. You know, info about your tower, the surrounding tree species, etc. Uh, uh, all right. Just, you know, have a look at it. Make sure it's in ship shape. 
Okay. Okay, yeah, it's up. Why are you acting like this? Great. Just wonderful. Do you see the tree in the top row, second from the left? Sure. It's the, uh... No. You don't need to tell me. Just, um, internalize it. It's, it's a great tree. And there's an area called, um, that tree's name in your sector that maybe you should take a midday hike to. Maybe. Oh. Uh, yeah, okay. Um, maybe I should go for a hike. Nothing like an afternoon in the Rockies, I tell ya. Radio me the moment you get there. Sounds good to me. Alright, guys. Let's get out there and uh, see what's up. gotten pretty interesting some weird stuff's been going on we got to find out who or what has been causing all this stuff to happen and I guess get them to quit <laughs> all right let's see where Cottonwood Creek is Cottonwood Creek okay Looks like it's to the east, I guess. <laughs> no, it's to the south. All right. Make sure we're on the right path. Yes, we are. Let's see what's in that uh, box. Supply cash. Okay. All right, let's get rolling. Comwood Creek, we're almost there. Someone's still following me. going the wrong way. Man, whoever's following me can really, like, move around quick on my left, then he's on my right, then he's on my right, and then he's on my left. <laughs> Alright, I think we're here. This is nice. A ski. Cottonwood Creek. game always beautiful let's see what's up am I here I 
So I have to go back in radio. What's going on here? <laughs> this is weird, I'm not getting the option to uh, call her. Up oh, there we go. Uh, I'm here at Cottonwood Creek. You see the cash box there? Uh, it must be around here somewhere. It is. Find it and open it. I changed the code. It's five six seven eight. Are you kidding me? I was in a rush. Okay, let's go find. Let's go find that uh, supply cash. Here it is. Uh, okay, found the cash box. Great, open it. Copy the information off this map. Ah, new radio. Got it now. Good. I spent all day getting you that radio. <laughs> I hiked to a cash box, lied to a ranger, lied to another ranger, and hopefully you are now holding a clean, untapped radio. Hopefully. Holy fuck, Henry. We have to get into that site. Whatever what the fuck is going on? People are listening to us? I don't know. Our radios are tapped? Are you fucking serious? Radios are definitely tapped. That's why I left you the one you just got. How 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 is this even possible? Yeah. I don't know, Henry. What do you know? You know that I'm scared. Are there any other lookouts this is happening to? Someone else in on this? Anyone? <sighs> this is just happening to us. Everyone else is fine. Are you sure? Yes. I've tried to bring it up to Chimney Rock, Elk's Fork, and Beartooth Lookout, and every one of them got confused. Asked me if I'm okay and if I need to be relieved. Our fucking state coordinator asked if I was just having lady troubles. So no, this isn't happening to anyone else, and I'm done asking. Who is doing this? I don't know who could be doing this. <sighs> Henry, I've been at this job off and on for 13 years. Sometimes here, sometimes over near Jackson, a couple times down in Wind River. And nothing like this has ever happened before. Am I just making all of this up? I mean, the eavesdropping, the spying, is this... Fuck, are you... Are you is any of this real? What? Are you serious? Maybe I'm, I'm just... Maybe I'm just losing my mind. What? Like Julia. Maybe it's happening to me, and, and I'm imagining that I have a boss out here and that we're being spied on. Henry. Maybe there was something in the water, or our condo was underneath some power lines, and, and you, Delilah, you're not real. Henry, Henry, think about her. If what happened to her were happening to you, you wouldn't even be able to realize it. Okay. Henry. Sweetie, I am real and this is happening. I'm as real as the sky is blue. Take a second and then call me back. I'm on your side. 
Okay. Hey. Uh, I just thought of something not, um, not great. What is it? I filed a report that said that neither of us ever talked to or saw those girls, the ones that Ooh. went missing a few weeks back. So? I'm sorry, I, I'm not following you. Henry, our radios were tapped the entire time we talked about it. Maybe even your uh. first day when you had the run-in with them. Oh. Oh, no. Oh, yes. And now someone probably has a transcript of that entire conversation. And I've filed a report that's a blatant lie. Oh, and those girls are still missing. Yep. Uh. Fuck, Delilah. Fuck, indeed. We really need to get to the bottom of this. Yeah, I agree. <laughs> Let's get over to Wapiti Meadow. Crippled Gulch. Just climb on down here. Hopefully the rope doesn't break this time. <sighs> Looks like we're good. All right. Head on through um, Jonesy Lake to get there. Hopefully we'll find out what's going on. Looks like I went the wrong way. <laughs> nope. <sighs> All right, we're almost there. Let's see what's going on. Break this uh, lock off. I'm busting the gate down. There's nobody around, and it's the quickest way in. Copy that. <clears throat> oh, that was really easy smashed open the gate. Should I try to fix or hide this? No, screw it. Okay, then. Alright, let's see what's going on here. Oh! Ow! Oh, well, 
That's unfortunate. <laughs> I got stung by a bee. Okay. Is is that it? Yeah. Did it did it hurt? Yes, kind of. <laughs> okay, I'm I'm sorry. Dr. Simmons. Oh great, it's night time. Uh well let's see what's up. Uh, my guess is aliens, so we'll see. Government uh, alien research. I'm probably right, but I guess we'll see. But there's something. A radio tower, it looks like. Interesting. Okay, I'm at the site. I don't see anybody around. Lucky for us. Yeah, lucky for us. D, there is some serious comms equipment out here, wireless stuff. What do you mean? I'm talking a big 20-foot tall transmission tower. And they could probably listen to whoever the hell they want. They're nestled down in this valley, which makes it impossible for you or any lookout to see them. Hmm, maybe I should be more careful. Okay, it's like a geological dig site. Now they're doing something with the soil out here too. It's all gridded off. Hey, maybe you were right about the lichens. <laughs> hey, it's all beepy. And there are all sorts of contraptions and shit out here. Like what? dishes and stuff on metal legs there are wires all over the place I don't know I'm not really up on high tech I mean how the hell did they get all this stuff out here the Army Corps of Engineers put our towers out here so you think it was the government I have no idea I, I just mean it's possible I mean every once in a while I'll need a lookout who's deep into that like black helicopter conspiracy shit Maybe they actually flew it out here in one of those. What is that? I'm gonna go check it out in a second. I'm in their main tent. What's it like? It's definitely some sort of monitoring station. wonder where they are. All, all of their stuff is here. And they know you're there, so see what you can find and get out. Okay. Nothing bad could ever happen to me here. I found their main monitoring desk. Oh my god, what do you see? Seriously, at this stage, I'd believe just about anything. <laughs> There's a box here with a dial. It has a needle, like it measures earthquakes. You mean like a lie detector? Yeah, I'm not sticking around to get hooked up to it. Fill generator. Wednesday and Sunday. Okay. Shit. Got a map here that confirms they're tracking my... our... people's movements. The map's got all sorts of paths and areas marked off on it. There are lines that look like some of the paths I normally take. Are you positive it's you? I'm not sure, but I think so. There's some sort of monitor. I don't know what it does. Maybe air quality or something? Maybe they're keeping data on everything that could impact our moods. That looks possible. This is crazy. The desk in here is a mess. 
I mean, it's, it's like someone was in a rush or knocked a bunch of stuff over on accident. They're measuring the barometric pressure, too. Why? Maybe it's just a diversion. I mean, this stuff looks like it just got lifted out of the space shuttle. <laughs> I have to tell you, if I found out this was NASA, I'd be a hell of a lot happier. Okay, so there's a log here that tracks the movement of four distinct subjects. You and me? Uh, yeah, definitely me. And I suppose you too. What about the other two? Maybe the Goodwins? What if they were following them last summer? God, Henry, I don't know. If they were, there's no way Brian knew. He would have said something. Yeah, I can't imagine a kid like that could have kept this under his hat. We'll talk this over and figure out how to get the hell out of here. Well, let's keep this. This place sleeps three. They've got a row of cots here. So they live and work in the same tent? Yeah, it's all one operation. Huh, like us. Yeah, like us. Well, let's open the hard case. Anderson Wave Finder, Wave Receiver. Locates any signal. <laughs> Green light equals target straight ahead. Distant light equals strength of signal. Tone equals source of signal discovered. Huh. Okay, this thing is losing its mind, beeping like crazy. I can hear it. What, what's it after? I don't know. I'm gonna go find out. So it's definitely to the north. Okay... Probably by the thoroughfare basin. Ah. Oh. Looks like it's in here. This is weird. So if there's a tone, it means we found the source of the signal.
It's got to be like right in there. Black box. What? Oh, man. Are you shitting me? What's going on? What? Here? What is it? There's a folder of reports here. What do they say? Their assessments about the two of us. There's stuff in here about Julia. Like what? Stuff I didn't tell you. This is... What, what does it say about me? You said there was one about me. And it looks like they've been following me around. What I do when I'm out hiking? Jesus! Henry, do you hear me? It says that you, you and your boyfriend are still together. What? We're not. They're messing with us. Yeah. Okay. They are. How do they even know who he is? How the hell does this... I'm so sick of letting these people do this to us. We should just burn the place down. Wait, Think what? about it. Worst case scenario. Delilah. What? Think about it. I am, and I think it's insane. They'd be fucked. Yeah, and how about if that fire comes up the mountain, or someone were to die in it? We call it in? We call it in? Yeah, maybe. My god, Delilah, no. No way. Well, maybe it's not the best idea. Yeah, it's definitely not the best idea. Ah, so fucking wound up! It's alright. I'm just gonna hike back. We have the wave receiver, and tomorrow we can figure out what to do. Yeah. Let's get back to Two Forks. Nothing bad's gonna happen now that we've discovered all this. Right? I'm, I'm gonna make it back to Two Forks. Safe and sound. Surely. smoke coming from the site. I, mean, I just climbed out of there and the bridge collapsed. What the hell happened to you? It's definitely not the best idea. It wasn't me. <sighs> what do we do? We just call it in like any other fire. And what about who started it? What about them? Uh, the person who started it? Yeah. We're talking about people watching us out here who are now burning the forest and everything in it around us. I, I, I don't know what to do about that. Except get the hell out. Yes, get us the hell out of here. I will. All right. <laughs> well, that's rather interesting. All right, guys. That's it for episode four of Will Plays uh, Firewatch. Uh, thank you for watching. Uh, don't forget to uh, like, comment, and subscribe. Bye.